Swifty here, we just picked up the Razer Lycosa gaming keyboard and now we're going to do a review on it. Here it is. The keys are rubber so they're non-slip and it's backlit illuminated which means that there's a light under each of the keys. It's also a touch screen over here so if I press this, WASD light up. If I hit it again, the whole keyboard lights up. So it's good for playing in the dark, just the way I like it. It's got an extra USB right there, and it's got an extra headphone and microphone jack. There's an option for gaming, which disables the window keys so that you don't accidentally press them when you're playing. And it's got macro capabilities for all the buttons, and it's got ghosting, which lets you press multiple keys by pressing one button. We'll get into that later once we start playing. So what I can say what I really like about this keyboard is the rubber keys. They feel really nice and it's macro capabilities. As a matter of fact, I'm gonna make a new macro right now. It's gonna, when I press one key, it's gonna activate five keys at a time. I have Snowfall in the game. I have that mod called Snowfall, uh, what's the name of it? Anyway, let me make the macro. Chord, one, two, three, four, five. Stop. And now what I'm going to do is I'm going to remove all the, the times in between key presses. Delete. Delete. Alright, it's done. Now I apply it. And notice this key lights up right here. Now F7 has become macro. Okay, here we go. Watch the bottom here. See, with Snowfall key press, you can tell that I'm hitting like five keys in one. <laughs> Alright, if I hit this key, which is the window key, see how it spans every time I press it? In order to disable it, you have to hit this key right here. The rest of the buttons are for Windows Media Player, and if you press this one, and you keep it pressed while you press the window key, you'll disable the window keys while you're in. And now if I spam it, it's disabled. Here's another really cool macro that I came up with, and it's making my life a whole lot easier. What I did was I assigned to F12 all my favorite web pages and it opens up WAP for me. So like say I turn on my computer, all I have to do is hit this one button and it opens all my email, my MMO champion, World of Warcraft, my YouTube page, and it also logs into World of Warcraft for me. So we're gonna do this right now. Well, watch what happens on the screen. It even logs in the password for me. There we go. <laughs> All I need to do is put the authenticator. Hold on. There's my character. Right there. Now if we go back to the web pages, I want to show you right now. It's my YouTube page. I got the MMO champion. I've got the World of Warcraft.com and I've also got my email, my Yahoo account. Here's the menu close up. This is the macro that I was using to activate all those windows and start up World of Warcraft. Right here you have basic commands and you can insert them directly into your macros and you can have additional commands. This is what I used. I use run. So I can open up the run program and uh, type the program I want. You could also just make it so that it just launches programs and you go straight to the folder where the executable is and you can just make one button launch a program if you want. But me personally, I like doing these macros, launch multiple programs at once. And here on the bottom, you could also use your mouse buttons and port them directly into the macro also. Here's my character. He's a gnome arms warrior. Now what I'm going to show is a macro with a razor like hose Like this right here. Now if we go back up, we're going to see the skills are done. Here we go. These are all the skills going off. Mad skills. <laughs> they go off pretty smoothly too. Check out those crits. <laughs> Check out the skills <laughs> going off.
there's no way you could press your fingers that fast. Yeah, arms, and I'm gonna use, use the macro just so I can show you guys. I'm gonna spam the macro. <laughs> Seriously. <laughs> Two rows. Oh, this is awesome. And that's how you pound two rows. Right? On two rows. Then now spam in the macro. Now run here. Come back 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 Oh, disarmed. He's gonna pay for that. Come here. Spam in the macro. <laughs> Rogue down. If you notice on the bottom left hand of the screen, you see the buttons flashing. That's a mod called Snowfall Key Press. And what it does is it lets an actual key press activate the skill instead of a key release, which is what the game has on default. Fighting two rogues. <laughs> two rogues has arms. <laughs> oh no. I'm having too much fun making macros with my new keyboard. If you're a clicker, where you click with your mouse pointer all your skills, or you have a mouse that doesn't have enough buttons, this keyboard will be a huge advantage for you. You can macro for raid DPS and perfectly time your skill rotations. Alright, <laughs> here's some crazy macro going off. Check it out. All my buttons. Too much stuff to handle though. My character's going nuts. I hope you enjoyed the review for the Razor Light Post.